Uh, just a quick one on these Chinese diesel heaters. Um, I'm just using it to go into the room to put a extra uh, an attempt to source of heat. Um, and it's been running away for about a month now. I have a cover there for it and it keeps it weatherproof. Um, I put an external tank. We're walking away fine until um, I started yesterday evening and um, went away and half an hour later I realised there was no um, no heat. I came out here and it had the dreaded error tent. Um, tried a few times, white smoke and I'm shutting down. Um, so I said, right, it's getting late now and um, thinking of all sorts of the worst possible things, uh, glow plugs, fuel pumps, fuel blockage, controller, motherboard part. Um, I said I'd sleep on it and I was thinking uh, what could cause it, I mean you have three things, you have fuel and the pump was walking away, you have ignition, the uh, glow plug and it seemed to be functioning, the other thing you'd have is uh, combustion air, the small pipe, so I said to myself, oh, I... and then I remember the night before we had torrential rain, I mean torrential and wind. So I said, is there any way that thing could have filled up with water and act like a water column? So I came out today and uh, thing off and there's a lot of water. Put the hose down low and water poured out of it. So after about two goes, the first go it ran for a good bit and then choked and a lot of white smoke. Second time it kept going, a lot of smoke for a long time. But now it's... Uh, it sorted itself out. I had it up at full five, over five uh, hertz pumping away, and uh, so that seemed to be the problem. So if anyone gets an error 10, that's another possible source. I had that clipped up there vertical, using one of these clips, and uh, so now I'm going to try what used to be what Chinese hat is it? I'm going to put a Chinese cabinet, uh, like what you'd have on the. Uh, wood stove flu. Uh, the, I just went to leave that adhesive uh, go off. So that's it now, she's running away right now. Tickety boo. Now, um, I, uh, I always like to uh, filter my fuel going into the tank, uh, even though I, ha I have put a bit of the filter there because I had one spare. Um, I didn't fit one in there. I believe in filtering the fuel going into the tank. Now I tried this first by getting one of these shakers and putting a filter in there but I found it wasn't working. Um, it takes too long to fill that. So that didn't work. So I just went away and got one of these funnels with the filter inside. You can remove that for cleaning. And uh, that's working out fine. The other interesting thing is to do with the pump. Before this now, the uh, pump consumption. I know Ozzy John and them have this uh, factor of 0 0.02 milliliters per stroke. Um, so if I did the maths, I'm using a lot more than that. Now, I had this open the other day to change that old green fuel line for the White Nylon. And I had a look at the pump and it's got 222, that means 0 0.0222. So over the hours that works out is quite a bit more. So I have uh, I have um, put markings on the tank now and I'm going to uh, monitor but I'm using more than the mathematical. So that was my lockout 10 issue. She's running away tickety boo now. For anyone who's uh, interested, that's another source. Another thing that I'd mentioned uh, a lot of comments about the fuel pump can't be horizontal, it must be at least 30 degrees pointing upwards or more because of this uh, air locking and stuff. So I have a Webasto on the board. 10 years now so I had a look at that and I took off the panel and the pump was horizontal 
So I said to myself, surely I would have followed, followed uh, Babasto's instructions. So I got out the, uh, the manual. It's amazing how many of the diagrams that are in uh, the Babasto manual are in the Chinese manual. Um, but what, when it comes to the fuel, mount the fuel pump horizontal. Do not mount the fuel pump at an angle. And it has a diagram where there's a green tick for the pump being horizontal and a red X across the one that's about 30 degrees at an angle. In other words, it is a button to put the pump at an angle. That's interesting.